blood supply of scaphoid. The scaphoid receives its blood supply from branches of the radial arch. The scaphoid has a bullar branch and a dorsal branch. The dorsal branch is responsible for 80% of the scaphoid blood supply, whereas the bullar branch supplies the rest 20%. The bullar branch is a branch of the superficial primer branch of the radial artery, and it enters the scaphoid through the distal pole. The dorsal branch is a branch of the dorsal carpal branch of the radial artery, and it enters the scaphoid through the dorsal ridge. Following its entry through the dorsal ridge, it supplies the waist and proximal pole of the scaphoid through retrograde blood. So, in the blood supply of scaphoid, we see that the distal pole is well supplied, whereas the waist and proximal pole receives its blood supply only through a retrograde intraosseous blood flow. So, any fracture at the level of the waist or proximal to the waist can interrupt this blood supply, leading to avascular necrosis of the proximal fragment of the fracture. That is why scaphoid fractures are prone to avascular necrosis of the proximal fragment. If you like these videos, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for further videos. Also comment in the comment section regarding the topics you will like to be covered in the future videos. Thank you.